You see, what we're talking about here is where your boundaries of your job begin and end. And when I talk to you like this, I'm obviously examining you as an employee. Do you have the ability to recognize my authority in this store? And do you have the ability to recognize that companies get harmed by this sort of publicity ever more? You don't remember a lot of the big fiascos of the 70s and 80s and early 90s by companies and corporations and manufacturing organizations that screwed themselves into such publicity that it went on for weeks. This is not a big deal. Someone who is homeless outside of our store, someone who is impoverished outside of our store, is never a problem. They become a problem when you allow them to come into our store and start soliciting your friendship. We don't need you to be producing friendship like this in this way at our store. Because the truth is that people who are really trying to produce a life are really working hard on their job hunt. It does make it hard in the concept of compassion for people who are working hard on their job hunt from whatever location they feel safest, whether it's outside the store, whether it's in a library, whether it's in a hotel that they can afford, it doesn't matter. It is not our business what's going on there, but what is our business is to protect our store from stupid lawsuits and lethalities against our employees. We do know the difference between people who are productive in society despite being homeless and people who are not doing that for any purpose or any need of their life. I know that's hard for you to get as I'm talking to you as a manager and you are my subordinate technically on our organization chart. You are not responsible for ever calling a local law enforcement on anyone outside the store. And if you can't handle a little bit of rebuttal, if you can't handle a little bit of narcolepsy, and if you can't handle a little bit of Tourette's by someone every once in a while, then maybe you're not the right employee for our store. People have all kinds of conditions, and it is immoral for you to presume that any of those things have anything to do with codependency or mental health. What we know every day in America is that little employees inside our stores can be commandeered and taken off by being foolish about going outside the store to get involved with situations that have very little to do with our company. Yes, it might be on the front part of where we have the lines on the inside of our actual physical facility that we rent, but on the outside is an outside world, and most of those things will dissipate pretty quickly. Other people in the community who are outside observing, hearing, and whatnot can sometimes, with the right tactics, intervene and dispense. But our job, is job inside of our retail store and our retail shop as sales employees of all these vended products and all these major corporations is to make sure none of them are brought up in any type of unnecessary publicity.